What's up, folks? I'm back again reviewing one of my favorite WWE video games, which I said in one of my last videos, WWE All-Stars. Now, this game really is cool. I mean, it came out in 2011, and um, a, lot of, a lot of people were excited about it. But it turns out the game, you know, it's not as fun as everybody expected it to be. But it really is a cool game. And also, this is the last WWE video game they ever made for PlayStation 2. One thing I like about it is because it's, it's like the older WWE video games. And what I mean by old is like the real old ones that came out for, you know, regular PlayStation or even a PC. I don't know if you guys out there know what this game is. It's called, it's called Super WrestleMania. It's similar to that, except it's got a bigger roster and it's um and it's got you know like it's like an older WWE game made into a newer one. This isn't too old. It came out in 2011, but I I just want to show y'all everything. So I'm gonna show y'all the roster first. I also want to show you the type of matches you can do. We got a tornado tag team match. Steel Cage, Extreme Rules, and Elimination. So you can do an Elimination Tag Match, Tornado Tag, Triple Threat, Fatal 4-Way, Handicap Match. But the only kind of match you can really do is just a regular match, Tag Team, Steel Cage, or Extreme Rules. Which, my favorite on here, I would say, is the Extreme Rules. You can do from one on one, tornado tag, triple threat, fatal four way, handicap. In a handicap match, that's two on one. And for all of you out there who haven't played this before, I'd advise you to do a handicap match your first time ever playing, you know, to be easier to win. And you can, so you can do a handicap match. So I'm just going to show you the roster. Now sometimes you can get the controller to play for both, but you can't on here. It says you must assign a controller in order to continue. So I'm going to show you all the roster. Starting on the edge over here, we got Jimmy Snuka. Mr. Perfect. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, Randy Savage, Bret Hart, Hulk Hogan, and you can create superstars too. You can pick random, that's anybody. So now I'm going to show you all the rest of the roster. We got John Cena, CM Punk, Rey Mysterio. Kofi Kingston, Undertaker, Edge, Kane, Drew McIntyre, Jack Swagger, The Miz, Randy Orton, John Morrison, Sheamus, Big Show, and something funny I want to tell you all about Randy Orton. He looks a lot like an alien in the face on this game. It's like an alien version of him. Anyways, back to the roster. Big Show. Triple H. The Rock. More of the legends are on the left side over here. Andre the Giant. Ultimate Warrior. Jake Roberts. Rowdy Rowdy Piper. Eddie Guerrero. Sergeant Slaughter. And Shawn Michaels. One thing I love about this game is it has a lot of legends on it, which makes it so cool. And like I said in my old vid old vid other video, I'm old school and I like old school stuff. And this is like a old school, you know, blast from the past. And here's all the arenas they have. You got SmackDown. Raw, WrestleMania, 
All Stars, SummerSlam. Let's get it to look good. Look at SummerSlam. And um, Retro SmackDown. That's what it looked like back in the early 2000s. Now I'm going to tell y'all how to unlock a few things. Starting off, SmackDown, Raw, and WrestleMania are the only arenas unlocked. Yet, um, All-Star, SummerSlam, and Retro SmackDown will be locked. Now here's how you have to unlock them. There's not really much on this game as much as it would be on the regular game, but it's just fun. And I just know, I just want to tell y'all the moves on here, they're not realistic at all. Like, for instance, John Sand does his attitude adjustment. He'll do it like 20 feet in the air, but it's still, I still like this game. So, to unlock this stuff, you got to go to Path of Champions. So, you have to um, either complete the Undertaker's thing, the World Heavyweight Championship. SummerSlam, you complete this, you'll unlock the All-Stars arena. Then there's Randy Orton. You have to beat Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. And if you do that, you'll unlock the Retro SmackDown. And last but not least, Degeneration X. To beat, If you beat them, complete all this, you'll unlock SummerSlam. Which there's only like 12 matches in this whole thing. Let's take a look at Undertaker. I completed all three of these. And look, you can pick anybody you want. And, and for instance, your first time playing, I'd advise you to play for someone big, like Andre the Giant or Big Show. And that's something else I want to tell you. To do the Degeneration Etch, the Generation X match. Um, I'd advise you if you just want to hurry up and get it done with, pick Big Show and Andre the Giant to be your to be your team. Imagine that. That's over a thousand pounds of a tag team you got right there. I mean, they're unstoppable if you're gonna play for both of them. So that's the um, Path of Champions. So that's how you unlock the arenas. Now, to, now some superstars will be locked too. I can't keep up with all of them who are locked. It's been a while since I played this. But you gotta do this to unlock them. You got the Greatest Warrior, Ultimate Warrior versus Sheamus. And I think Ultimate Warrior was locked. Not sure, I think it was. To unlock a person, you gotta play as them. Like on this one, Greatest High Flyer. Eddie Guerrero with the Frog Splash and Rey Mysterio with the 619. Now I know Eddie Guerrero was locked, so if you want to unlock him, you have to play for him and win the match. Both of these were already unlocked. Ricky Steamboat and Kofi Kingston. Now I already know both of these guys were locked. Mr. Perfect and The Miz were both locked. Both of these already be unlocked. Both of them are unlocked too. Greatest Big Man, Andre the Giant versus Big Show. Because that would be a great match if it was real. And this is perfectly awesome, Mr. Perfect versus The Miz. Survival Lifestyles. Stone Cold Steve Austin versus CM Punk. Which a lot of WWE fans have wanted to see that. That's one reason why they added it to this game. Edge and Bret Hart. I'm not sure about Bret Hart. I think he's already unlocked. And I don't know about Edge neither. But um, that's the excellent evolution execution I meant. Golden Snake, Jake the Snake Roberts versus Randy Orton. Be the Rattlesnake versus the um 
versus the Viper. Stars and tri Stripes Showdown. We got Sergeant Slaughter versus Jack Swagger. I already know Swagger's locked, so if you want to unlock him, I'd advise you to play for Swagger. Which I know most of you would want Sergeant Slaughter to win. But to unlock Swagger, so you can beat on him, of course, you want to unlock him. Now we got the biggest superstar. These are probably the top two love superstars in all of WWE. John Cena and Hulk Hogan. So that'd be a great match as well. Both of them are unlocked, so you don't have to worry about completing it. But in order to go on, you got to complete everything. Most characteristic. Got Randy Savage and John Morrison. Both of them are already unlocked. But I do know if you win this, you'll unlock a new outfit for Randy Savage. Now we got Ruthless Aggression. Jimmy Snooker versus Kane in a steel cage match. Now both, both of these guys are... They're both locked. So you'll have to do the match again in order to unlock both of them. Steel cage match is the hardest match to win on this, but you'll get used to it. Might do a video on that later. And I said might. I'm not sure for a fact. I will. You got The Rock versus Triple H. Both of them are unlocked. You got Pride of Scotland. Roddy Roddy Piper versus Drew McIntyre. Because both of them are from, from Squat Scotland. You got Tongue Tied there. That's my bad. They're both from Scotland. Now I know Drew McIntyre is locked. So you'll have to make sure he wins in order to unlock him. And last but not least, Mr. WrestleMania. And I know Shawn Michaels was locked, so it'd be best to play for him in order to unlock him. And also, this is The Undertaker's Street. You know, Shawn Michaels will have to retire. I know a lot of you didn't want him to retire, so if you want him to win, I advise you to play for him. The Undertaker's already unlocked. And that's it for the um, Fantasy Warfare. And that's it for the um, video game review. I hope y'all enjoyed it, and thanks for watching.